Giver is very sadistic. The power of Christ compels you. Yeah, The Giver's a great book. Final thoughts on The Giver. It's a decent book. Uh, can be sadistic with, spoiler alert, Jonas's father putting the new baby child after he released him into the trash chute because their society is screwed up in every way. Um, decent book. Six out of ten. Could be better. Leave it at that. Okay, also, at the end, it says they started down, Jonas felt himself losing consciousness, and with his whole self being willed to stay upright atop the sled, clutching Gabriel, keeping him safe, the runners sliced through the snow and the wind whipped, and the wind whipped at his face as they sped in a straight line through the inch, through the insen, in, insen, that seemed to lead to the final destination, the place that he had always felt was waiting, the elsewhere. He had, he held their future and their past. He forced his eyes open as they went downward, sliding, and all at once he could see lights, and he recognized them now. He knew they were shining through the windows of rooms, that they were red, blue, and yellow lights. They twinkled from trees in places where families created and kept memories, where they celebrated love. Downward, downward, faster, faster, suddenly he was aware that certainly no joy that below. Ahead, they were waiting for him. And that they were waiting, too, for the baby. For the first time, he heard something that he knew to be music. He heard people singing behind him across the vast distances of path of space and time from the places he had left through. He heard music too, but perhaps it was only an echo. I think the ending, what the author's trying to get it at, get at for that is she's trying to say that Jonas, when he got to the, or this is my interpretation of it, Jonas got to the top of the mountain. He started losing consciousness, but before he died, he was basically hallucinating of the sled and him going down, seeing the lights, and then hearing the music was him hearing beyond. So then, with him hearing beyond, that's why I said it was only an echo. And leave it at that. I thought the end was okay. And then, after he heard that echo, poof, dead. And then Gabriel slowly died after. And they died from starvation. That, that's, yeah, that's, that's it. Um, stay safe, to have fun, don't do bad things. End card crap.